To start trading on Blowfin Futures, the first thing you'll need is USDT, which is Tether, a stable coin that is equal to the US dollar in value. Basically, a blockchain dollar. The easiest place to buy it is on Coinbase. Coinbase is one of the largest and most popular places to purchase crypto via card or bank. So first, log into Coinbase or create an account if you don't already have one. Complete any quick ID verification steps if asked, then go to the buy and sell and search for Tether USDT. Enter how much you want to buy and confirm your purchase. Coinbase only supports USDT on the Ethereum network, which is also known as ERC20. That's important. ERC20 simply means that the token runs on the Ethereum blockchain. When you send it to another platform, you'll have to pick the same network on both sides. In this case, that's Ethereum. Once your USDT shows up in your Coinbase portfolio, it's time to move it to Blowfin. Go to Blowfin, log in, and at the top of the page, click Assets deposit, choose USDT from the list, and you'll see a few different network options. Pick ERC20, which is Ethereum, and Blowfin will give you a unique deposit address. That's where you'll send your USDT from Coinbase. Copy that address carefully. It should look like this. Now, switch back to Coinbase, click send crypto, then paste your address. After that, select the asset and type the amount you wish to send. Click preview and then select the exchange since this is where we will be sending funds and search for Blowfin. Confirm your details and then double check again that the network is ERC20 before confirming the transaction. Press send now. Within a few minutes, your USDT will arrive in your Blowfin funding account. That's where all deposits land by default. From there, you will need to move your funds to your futures account before you can trade. Prime Automation trades futures, so we need to ensure it's in the correct wallet. To do that, go to Assets, Overview, Transfer, and you'll see two drop-down menus. In the From box, select Funding, and in the To box, choose USDT M Futures. The M stands for Margin, meaning you're transferring USDT into your Margin Wallet, which is what allows you to open and manage futures positions. Enter the amount of USDT you wish to move, and and click confirm. Once that's done, you're ready to go and configure the bots on Prime Automation.